Well, hey everybody, as promised, I thought I'd do a video here tonight to show you a little bit about um, what I was talking about with blocking apps and removing apps. Let's say that uh, you, you decided to download uh, the most popular words of 2015. And of course, later today, we found out that uh, the app allowed third parties in and now you're stuck with uh, some of your information just being put out on the internet willy-nilly through Facebook. So, uh, a lot of people said, well, Pat, how do we get rid of that? So I thought I would go in, and you are right now, let's say we're at our home um, home page here, our home screen for Facebook. We're going to come up here to Settings, and come down to Settings, and we're going to come over to Apps. And we'll click Apps. And here are all the apps that I have. And now notice that I have some set to me only, or only me, I should say. Some are set to friends. Uh, mostly are set to only me. Friends, 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 only me. And so when, when I do accept a new app, what I do is I set it to only me. That means that the only person it will post to is only me. I'm the only one in my wall who's going to see this app. And so let's say I play a game and um, for example My Vegas, I have that set so only My Vegas friends or other friends who are on My Vegas can see that I'm playing that game. So if you go to my profile, you're not going to see a bunch of My Vegas, My Vegas, My Vegas stuff. You're just it, unless you are another player of my Vegas, then you'll see that stuff. So anyway, let's say, for example, that I have no more use for, um, I don't even know what this is, so we're going to get rid of it. Uh, we're going to get rid of Von Von. So all you need to do is just hit the X next to it, and that removes it. It's going to give you a double check to say, Removing this app um, affects this, that, and the other thing, but we don't care, so we're just going to hit remove. So that takes care of that. I've seen people that have had over uh, 250, 300 apps uh, on their page here. I, I really don't have that many. What I do have, I use quite a bit. So, uh, you know, I really don't use um, NBC anymore because the voting was over for something. So. No need to have NBC on there. And that was sharing things with friends anyway. And again, we'll just remove that. Um, if I want to remove um, another one here, we'll do one more. Um, social Cam, they're out of business. They don't do anything anymore, so we're, we'll remove Social Cam. So that's all you have to do. If, if your news feed is filling up with junk, uh, if you keep getting pop-ups on Facebook, if you keep getting you know these messages or or your 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 pages being spammed or your pages spamming other pages, then that's what you need to look for is some of these things. So again, you can always set um, change the uh, person that sees this so like paper karma is only me but I could go in here and I could change it um, to anybody I wanted to so anyway I'm just I could change it to all my friends I could change it to public I'm gonna keep it as only me and then I'm gonna just delete it so I don't need paper karma in there anymore so you're gonna see things that you don't even know that you accepted uh, if you don't you know them, if you don't use them, you can always remove them. You can always add them back later if it's something that that is drastically needed. So I don't need bands in town. Um, and the fewer things you have on here, the less cluttered your uh, news feed and other things will be. And probably a little bit better that your your Facebook program will run. So we, of course, cannot get rid of B-dubs and a few of those other ones. So that's what we have here. I hope this is easy to follow along with. Again, uh, we go to Settings. We go to Apps. 
and we show all you could also um, show apps others use plugins things like that so uh, show all and that will uh, show all of what you have in your uh, your apps feed so hopefully that um, clears up some some issues and uh, clears up a little bit of uh, problems on what is accepted what's not accepted again anytime you accept a third party app you are just opening your Facebook page up to whatever so if we come up to and we'll, let's just do a quick search of uh, maybe there's a third party app in here if we can see one handy um, I don't really see one because I I've blocked so many of them Yeah, I, I've just blocked so many of them. There's not a whole lot left. So, um, anyway, that's what we do. We go to settings, and then uh, apps, and then you can take care of whatever you want right here. So, anyway, hopefully that clears up a few things for you. I'm Pat Palmer, the computer guy. You can always uh, send me a private message. If you do have questions, you can come to my The Computer Guy page and uh, ask questions there as well or post something to my wall and I get that answered for you as soon as I can. So enjoy the rest of the week and the Thanksgiving turkey gobble gobble. This is The Computer Guy signing out.